With no oxygen and almost zero pressure in space, 12 seconds of exposure to the vacuum of space would cause the blood in your body to boil. Your body would swell, just like a balloon being filled with air. Your lungs would collapse, and the saliva in your mouth would vaporize. This happens because the boiling point is significantly lower in the vacuum. The lower the pressure, the lower the boiling point is in that environment. Without the Earth's atmospheric pressure, the liquid or blood in the human body doesn't remain in its liquid form and will turn to gas, expanding your body to approximately twice your regular size. After 40 seconds of exposure in space, if you were not dead already, your entire body would become paralyzed. If you held your breath in space, the gas inside your lungs would expand significantly your lungs would be ruptured and you would be killed straight away. If you didn't hold your breath, you could survive for up to two minutes. So, if you find yourself expelled into the vacuum of space, the first thing you should do is exhale as much as possible. But what would happen after you die in space? Be sure to subscribe and like this video to be entered into our Amazon gift card giveaway. Be sure to comment, I subscribed after. If you were located where your body faces the sun, cosmic radiation would begin to burn your skin instantly. If you looked at the sun without any eye protection, your light-sensitive retinas would be fried and you would lose your eyesight. Depending on how distant you were from the sun, you would experience a temperature of at least 393 kelvins or 250 degrees Fahrenheit. However, you would certainly die much sooner because of suffocation. If you were located in a colder area, for example, in outer space, where our planet blocks out the sun, you would experience a temperature of, at most, 2.7 Kelvin, or minus 455 degrees Fahrenheit. Despite the freezing temperatures, you wouldn't freeze straight away. Due to the lack of conduction and convection in space, heat doesn't leave your body quickly enough. So, your death would happen as a result of suffocation instead. But what would happen after you die in space? If you die in space, there won't be any decomposition because there is no oxygen. In other words, germs have also died with you. This means that your undecomposed body will float in space forever, or at least until it bumps into something in space. We know that in the low Earth orbit, solar radiation heats space to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. So, if your body is on this side of the Earth, it'll be mummified due to the heat. If you happen to die in your spacesuit while your suit is in undamaged condition, your body will decompose in the suit as long as there is oxygen left. This is because the bacteria that went inside the suit with you will thrive on the remains of your body. When the oxygen runs out, the fermentation process will begin. Fermentation is when the anaerobic bacteria thrive on your body remains until all your body substrates are consumed. After that, the remains of your decomposed body will float in space forever, or until it hits something. 